Hi guys and welcome to Tech Based. In this video, we're gonna talk about an error from Windows 10 or Windows 11, which is when you go to internet connections, you see the error, you aren't connected to any networks, but your internet connection works fine. If you go on a browser and search up things, it works just fine. But in your internet settings, you have this error not connected, you aren't connected to any networks. Now, this issue can come up with also Windows updates not working because you get the error, some settings are managed by your organization. So this is actually a pretty bad problem if you encounter it because this could mean that your operating system is pretty much compromised and you either have some important missing files from Windows or Windows is just corrupted by itself. In this video, I'm going to show you a very quick and easy solution that you can try in order to fix this issue. And also this solution worked for other users as well. So the solution would be to completely reset the operating system without losing your files. For those of you who didn't know, Windows 10 and Windows 11 have this option to reset reset your computer. So if you just search up reset in the search box and click on reset this PC and click on reset this PC, you will get to this window which says reset this PC. If your PC isn't running well, resetting it might help. This lets you choose to keep your personal files or remove them and then reinstalls Windows. Just click on get started, select keep my files. This will keep all your files but will only uninstall apps and settings and of course will reset the operating system. Here, how would you like to reinstall Windows? I recommend you choose cloud download because this will download download a fresh ISO image of Windows and will install it for you when you go further with this process. If you go for the local install, maybe it will use files from the current installation, which is pretty much compromised or corrupted. If you click on view apps that will be removed, you will see the list of apps that will be removed after you reset your computer. After you're done, just click on reset and the whole process will, will take up to 30 minutes. You don't have to do anything, just wait. Basically, it will be just like Windows updates. It will restart, wait for a few minutes, and then you will be logged back into your operating system and you'll find on your desktop a file that will let you see all the apps that were removed and of course, if you want to install them after that, you can do that with no issues and you should be good to go. You should no longer have that error from internet settings that say that you aren't connected to any networks. I'm hoping this video is useful. If it was, don't forget to leave a like down below and also subscribe to the tech based channel with a notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. I was Emmanuel from tech based. Until next time, have a nice day.